Hi everyone, it's Jenny. Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's been such a long time since I last uploaded and I will talk about what's been happening lately in my life later in this video. So for today's video, I'm gonna do what my heart wants me to do in such a long time, aka a self-care errand or shall I say a glow-up vlog? Hmm. Anyway, you will see me change my hairstyle from its usual form and maybe see how it fails. I will also be doing a much needed sheet mask moment. I'm also gonna be doing my nails and working on my vision or mood board. So, let's start the video, shall we? I'm about to bleach my hair, but before bleaching, I'm applying baby oil to hopefully protect my hair. It's also recommended to not shower for 2-3 to three days before bleaching, which I did, so that the natural oil in our hair can protect our scalp and help minimize hair damage during the process.
guys so update um tapos na ang first application and ayan ito na yun siya and guys na ano kasi nalagyan sa ano sa scalp ko and super happy Okay, so voiceover Jenny here. I only realized that my voice here was really really low, so here I am doing a voiceover. As you can see, I'm doing a sheet mask moment. The sheet mask I used was from Skin Glow. It is the rejuvenating serum sheet mask that's for moisturizing and rejuvenating the skin. You're watching me putting on the sheet mask and also applying the extra serum to my neck. So while I'm letting it dry for about 15 to 20 minutes, I'm doing a live update here but since you can't hear me clearly, it's my duty as a voiceover Jenny to make it clearer. So first that I want to share is that I have my own phone. It's not the latest model but it can do its purpose the same as a regular smartphone. This is the Techno Pop 5 LTE. If you didn't know, the phone that I always use for online classes, as seen in my previous vlogs, is not mine, which I always put a disclaimer every time it makes it, its appearance. It's from my nanai or grandmother. I'm always grateful for the time that she let me borrow her phone because it was really helpful for my online classes, as well as my tita's laptop. We also bought a laptop of our own. The brand is new, which is called Jumper Tech. 
So thank you so much family for being generous with us. Next update. I now have a part-time job. I'm working as a customer service representative. The company is from abroad so my shift starts at night. Graveyard shift so I'm always adjusting my sleeping schedule every time I have work. Because my work is not every day, it's project based. So you can say that I'm earning my own money. This leads me to the next update which is my mental health. This video is a backlog so the date I filmed this was months ago and the way I'm feeling in those times were not the greatest. I experienced mostly pressured and anxious. I literally had an existential crisis. I questioned my worth and purpose in this world mostly because I'm anxious and pressured of my future. I'm only a year till my graduation, Pohon, and I don't know what's next for me. Whenever I think of that, my heart would feel so heavy and sometimes my breathing as well and I start to overthink and grit my teeth which eventually will make my headache. Many of you will think that this is not a big deal because we all go through this one way or another. And I know you're right, but there are factors why I'm thinking this way. For one, I'm the eldest child, so the pressure is 10 times fold. Well, at least for me. And I know we have various factors why we're all feeling emotions that's unfamiliar to us. But I want you to know that it's all valid. We feel these emotions because we're human. We're like all the others that will experience the future the universe have for us. So my only advice for this is let's think and plan our future but not overdo it. We must leave spaces for our loved ones and spontaneous moments so we can say that we lived our lives the way we wanted to because this is what's meant to be. And last update, I mentioned in one of my mini vlog episodes that I want to socialize more whether be it online or personal. And I'm actually keeping that goal, well, more of online because I have social anxiety. But if it's online, it's less stressful, so yeah. And that's it for this segment. everyone for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel 
and yeah see me in my next video god bless and goodbye